What is up YouTube, I'm Dredge here and today I'm gonna tell you how to overclock your graphic card no matter you use Intel ATI or even Nvidia. So these are the two device, I mean softwares which we are gonna use to overclock and I've provided the link below in the description so that you can check it out later. So the first thing is Tech Power Up GPU-Z which is kind of a software which allows you to know more of your graphic card and uh, what DirectX version it's using, your bus width, 64-bit or 32-bit and the main thing you gotta know is that the graphic card name is displayed or not like I'm using it here, Radeon HD4550. So if the drivers and uh, other stuff are not installed properly then you will not get this name. So make sure you uninstall it and reinstall it to get this properly and then head towards sensors and make sure GPU core clock, GPU memory clock, GPU temperature are running perfectly as you would and make sure that the GPU temperature is as low as possible because overclocking will make it heated up and you don't want to get messed up with heated up graphic cards. So coming to overclocking process we open MSI Afterburner. So now MSI Afterburner is the software which we are going to use to overclock our GPU. So core, core voltage, power limit and core clock. Um, basically core voltage and power limit are not in use and all you got to do is core clock, memory clock and fan speed. You got to ma make changes in this. So I've maxed it out and um, this is not in default. Maybe this would be in default or something like this. So to overclock it, uh, you can basically move the slider towards the max slowly and then hit apply. Go for gaming. If you see any changes, then well and good. If not, then gradually you can go for max and make sure that you make the fan speed also at max and hit apply and go for gaming. This should at least boost up to 10 to 15 frame rates and that should help in uh, gaming. A lot more help. So that is it all about overclocking and this is a quick tutorial. So I'll talk to you in the next video. Till then, oh, you can also follow me on Twitter below. Uh, the link is given in the description. So thanks for watching guys. I'll talk to you in the next video.